Oh, look at all the birds were supplied. Yeah, you find all three statues yeah, like in all three locations. Uh, and you let his uh, email his uh, his agent. He will fly you out to spend time uh, a whole week with him. In this case. So, yeah. No joke. <laughs> How many of y'all know why it says Indian land on some of the buildings? No. No? You don't know why? All right, so after uh, the prison was closed down in the 60s, the American Indian movement uh, was recognizing some of, one of the treaties that they have with the United States, saying that any federal lands that are not being used or occupied can be uh, basically taken back by indigenous groups. And so the American Indian movement saw this island and said, well, it belonged to indigenous peoples to begin yeah. with, and they're not using it, so we're going to occupy it. And so they came aboard and occupied it, and uh, they had to take it to court. They sued the United States government. Um, and it's kind of hard to sue the same government in their own courts, and they, they lost. And uh, in order to make sure that the United States didn't have to recognize that treaty, they uh, decided to turn it into a historical monument and open it up as a park. Yeah. Small child in blue, please don't pull yourself up on the rail. Thank you. Thanks, Dad. Appreciate it. Sorry. <laughs> Thank you. 